you very much. Uh, before I begin, I'd really like to extend a special welcome to our colleagues from Audi AG and, of course, the Volkswagen Group. So thank you very much for coming all this way. This is what we call the Audi TDI clean diesel clock. Now, clearly it doesn't tell time, it tells a story, and for us it tells a very powerful one about what TDI diesel technology has accomplished for our company and our customers. Because of the clean diesel's fuel efficiency, the 22,000 owners of Audi TDI models have saved precisely 4,583,773 gallons of gasoline. Some proper German engineer here. And of course, and counting. Thank you. Today, Today I am, I am proud, proud to, to announce, announce we are officially adding an A8, an, an A7, an A6, and a Q5 to our TDI offerings here in the United States. These models, as well as the 2013 Q7 TDI, are being introduced with an all-new engine. The leading consumer rating magazine just named Audi as the brand with the most reliable European vehicles on the market. And October 2012 was the 22nd consecutive record sales month for Audi in America. As a matter of fact, I'm here to tell you that we've already surpassed last year's record-breaking sales number, and we still have five weeks to go in the year. We're not betting on one technology in the hopes of achieving a sustainable future. We're betting on a sustainable future. We're not betting on one technology in the hopes of achieving a sustainable future. We're betting on a sustainable future and developing a whole host of technologies that we believe can get us there. The best part of all, we just started to tap the potential that diesel technology can offer. That's why we believe the efficiency gains that diesel offers today aren't a ceiling, they're a floor. We believe diesel can be even cleaner, even more powerful, even more efficient in the days ahead. Clean diesel is clearly a fuel that makes good business sense for car companies. So here's Audi's position or our challenge to policymakers at the state and federal level. Let's level this playing field, or in our case, the road. And let's see just how dramatically clean diesel can lower America's fuel consumption and carbon emissions. If we do these things, we know diesel will do in the market exactly what it does on the road, outperform. We think it's a choice a lot more drivers are absolutely going to enjoy making. Thank you very, very much. We internally felt very good about it, but of course, anytime you spoke to the market, they said, well, it's not going to happen because of old diesel perceptions about sootiness, old diesel perception about vibration and smoke. They can't find gas stations. And uh, the truth be told, that's not reality. This is high performance, hyper efficient, clean diesel. And when it hit the marketplace, consumers decided, and bang, it took off. So uh, we are very optimistic. That's why we're bringing four more of them. We're not in the business of bringing things that don't sell. We're in the business of bringing things that do sell, and that's exactly why we're bringing them. There's no behavioral change for the consumer. There's no infrastructure change in the market. And it gives you clean performance right off the bat. So that is the biggest selling proposition. As I mentioned, it's a matter of moving your right hand from this pump to that pump and putting it in. 30% fuel economy savings from right there. And not even to mention the fact that you get more range from that, you get better residual values on the car, future values on the car. It makes sense. 